All right, hey everybody. My name is Adam. This is video two on things that would make AEW better, right? Or how to fix AEW. And uh, today we're going to talk about uh, step two. And step two, the way I would fix AEW, the second step would be to stop taking every discarded WWE wrestler. In my opinion, picking up every discarded WWE wrestler doesn't do any good for your product. Look at WCW in the early 90s, right? They picked up Hulk Hogan, Macho Man, Randy Savage, uh, whoever else. Those are just two guys, which I love those guys. Don't get me wrong. I'm not disparaging them one darn bit. But as WWF, WWE, they were WWF at the time, is making new stars that rise up, right? You have these other wrestlers that have name value. Hulk Hogan has name value. Macho Man Randy Savage has name value. But the quality of work is diminishing due to their age and uh, other bumps they've taken and, and what they put their body through doing uh, their, 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 you know, most uh, critical time period. So quit taking every discarded WWE wrestlers. Now, that doesn't mean don't take any. Daniel Branson was a good uh, was a good pickup. Um, he who shall not be named was a good uh, was a good pickup. Uh, what they did with him was terrible. Um, I know that's a polarizing issue uh, for wrestling fans, but I think what they did with him was just atrocious. Uh, what they did to him was even worse. Uh, but WWE picked it up and ran with it. But wrestlers like uh, Mark Henry, Big Show. You don't see them. You don't see them on camera. Unless you're hiring them for maybe an off-camera role or something like that. Like, I know, I think Arn Anderson works for AEW in a certain, like, producer or agent capacity or something like that. That's okay. I'm talking about on-screen talent. We've seen Big Show. I've seen Big Show maybe, what, two, three times? I've seen Mark Henry maybe once. So, on-screen talent. Um, Bray Wyatt, it, he sucked. Uh, I, I think Bray Wyatt just sucks, period. But, uh, who are some other, uh, Serena? She was supposed to change the face of the women's division. And, or Soraya, excuse me, Soraya. She was supposed to change the face of the women's division. And, what has she done? Um, uh, you know, it's just... Quit picking up the WWE's discards. The people, the, the the people that WWE didn't want. It's not going to value. It's it's not going to create any more value for your for your content. Create your own wrestlers, right? Like uh, Sasha Banks. Every people know who Sasha Banks is. Not many people know who Mercedes Monet is. Uh, you know, which well, I'm going to talk about that in a different video how to debut your wrestlers, because they debut their wrestlers all wrong and everything like that, in my opinion. Uh, but I'm not running a multi-billion dollar wrestling company because I don't have a multi-billion dollars. But I think if they quit that, if they made their own stars, right? Like, uh, and, or maybe, you know, took like a WWE, oh, Edge, Co uh, Adam Copeland, Edge, perfect example. Uh, Christian Cage, which he, he hasn't been in WWE in forever, so maybe that's 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 a, a misnomer. Uh, he was more of a TNA guy than he... He went from WWE to TNA, then from AEW, I think. I'm um, working off the top of my head here. But grow your own stars, right? Maybe take a, a, a mid-card, lower mid-card WWE guy that has the talent. He has to have talent now. That's, that's one kind of, you know, uh, a prerequisite here. And repackage them and turn them into, you know, one of your guys. Look what they did with Stunning Steve Austin. And they turned him into Stone Cold... Or he turned himself, really, into Stone Cold Steve Austin. And one of the most popular wrestlers of all time. 
uh, pretty much. One of the most successful wrestlers of all time, uh, pretty much. Uh, you can debate whether he sold more merchandise during the 316 era than Hulk Hogan did through Hulkamania, but then you got to factor in the benefit of the internet into the 316 era and, uh, and, and, and stuff like that. But anyway, if AEW created their own talent and quit just picking up every discarded WWE wrestler, uh, I think that would fix AEW in the long run. Uh, thanks for listening to my rambling. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like the video, subscribe to uh, subscribe to my channel, and I uh, look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thank you for watching.